the Summit Juvenile Hurdle is next, and this is a Grade 2 Juvenile Hurdle for four-year-olds, of course. And let's take a look at the full list. of top one is a needle pin for Ryan Costello. Bally Tuck for B. Fotheringham. That's a new trainer, so welcome to you. Bold Highlander for Martin Leedham. Bonfire Shrill for Dan Hughes. More of the same for Joshua Sutherland. Royal Portrait, Jim Murray. Wait and see. Craig Beckwith. Classy for David Hooley. Modine for Alex Cherry. Moving Guerre for Ryan Costello. Newlands and Nigella Lawson for Paul Rhodes. Paperweight Finder for David Robertson. Ruby Swirl for Alex Cherry. And Zone Zero for Graham Clutterbuck. So there's your 15 then. And called in, and away they go. Making their way towards the first of the flights of hurdles. And as you can see, we've moved course. I think we're at Doncaster now. And moving Guerre on the inside is just about the leader from Needle Pin. So it's the Ryan Costello pair that are the two leaders then at the moment in these two different sets of silks. And they're about four or five lengths clear of Royal Portrait, who is in third. Then Bonfire Schwill and more of the same. Keep an eye out for the new trainer to see what his colours are. I think it's Bally Took, isn't it? That's the pink with the sort of purple stars. I think as they get finally get to the first flight, which they're all safely over, with wait and see just the back marker. So they're settled down, they've sorted themselves out, they're quite well strung out already, to be honest. And moving Guerre leads by about half a length to a needle pin in second, then a gap of four to Bonfire Schwill, who's gone into third. Then Royal Portrait in the black and red is fourth. And the black and red hoops on the inside, fifth place for more of the same. Paperweight finder for David Royston is next, and the purple and white stripes on the inside of Bold Highlander with Ruby Steel in those Alex Cherry orange sleeves just at the back of that first group and also at the head of the second group as they take number three the second one of his horses being Modine looking towards the back wait and see is still just a back marker with also Newlands and Zone Zero towards the back as well as Nigella Lawson as well so it's the Costello pair that continue to show the way then moving where on the inside of a needle pin then Bonfire Shrill still there in third with Royal Portrait and Paperweight Finder together then comes more of the same in the Dennis the Menace hoops with Bold Hunter on the inside then Ruby Swirl and Classy and Modine and then Bally Took and Nigella Lawson after that one and then Newlands with Zone Zero and Wait and See waiting to see at the back if it can pass all the other horses in the race. So they're racing downhill in there. They're well inside the final mile and they're coming down towards the next flight shortly with Moving Guerre leading by about three quarters of a length through Stable Mate and Needle Pin in second. Bonfire Schwill is third. Then Royal Portrait is back in fourth as they get over flight number four and it was a Needle Pin that made a really bad mistake there and has lost second place to Bonfire Schwill. They've got three more flights left to take there now and Moving Guerre is two lengths clear of Bonfire Schwill in second then a Needle Pin. Then Royal Portrait. Paperweight finders after that one more of the same trying to get into it so too is Royal Swarm Bold Highlander is still there Bally Tooks running a good race on his debut then comes Classy and Modi Nigella Lawson hasn't got cooking yet then comes Zone Zero wait and sees the back marker but it's moving where in the lead by two to a needle pin and a royal portrait and needle pin trying to recover from that mistake but would have taken a bit of the stuffing out of it moving where though he's still in front from a needle pin royal portrait bonfire shrill the one looks to be going really well is more of the same bold highlander trying to come around the outside toast so too is ruby swirl they've only got three furlongs to go and they've still got three flights to take this is the third last over it they go and it's still moving where in the lead from royal portrait now paperweight finders coming into it then newlands then comes bold highlander trying to get into it as well around the outside look at this bally took running a big race over the second last they go and moving Guerre's in front now being pressed by Newlands and Royal Portrait more of the same Bally took on the outside is throwing down a big challenge and it's Royal Portrait then coming out towards the final flight Royal Portrait in the lead Bally took in second went right through it and it's Royal Portrait racing away then as they caught towards the line and Royal Portrait's going to take it for Jim Murray it's going to be a mighty close thing for second probably just Newlands more of the same then Bally took a big race on debut Bonfire Shrill dropped out to be last and the Doncaster crowd can cheer a Jim Murray winner a good comfortable winner as well maybe throwing down a challenge for the triumph and raw portrait for Jim Murray is the winner more of the same Joshua Sullivan second Newlands for Paul Rhodes was third Bally took for B fathering on a brilliant debut to finish fourth in a grade two, fifth was Paperweight Finder for David Robertson.